Good evening. This is the news at 8 on Remo TV. I'm Naomi Oje. For our headlines, Ogun APC on the verge of losing card carrying members over injustice. Court grants Ogun Speaker over 300 million naira bail. Buhari congratulates new British Prime Minister, Truss. Harry Saint Germain superstar Kylian Mbappe leaves the door open for future Real Madrid transfer. BNXN sends gratitude following his next rated Hedis Awards. Let's take a short break and we'll be right back. Welcome back. The news in full. Action of the Ogun State House have political movement under the leadership of Alaji Malam Garba are allegedly set to dump APC, the ruling party for PDP, the opposition party, due to injustice, impunity, and sidelining of members that work for the emergence of this present administration under Prince Dakbo Abiodun. Speaking with the newsmen, Malam Suleiman Yusuf, the Yewa South local government chairman of the group, said, and I quote, We are not happy that we are being abandoned on what we labored for. Our members are complaining. Some have been enticed with money and sharing of positions that your oppositions gave them. And these have caused a lot of divide and separation in the group across the state. End of quote. 9,000 members that have PVCs are threatening to decamp to PDP because they have been denied access to dividends of democracy to their group. This defection would imply that the House of Political Movement loyalty and support to APC in Ogun would no longer exist. The Ogun State House of Assembly Speaker Olakunle Oluomo and two others were reminded at the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission today at the Federal High Court sitting in Lagos State over alleged 2.475 billion naira money laundering. Justice Daniel Osago ordered that they should be remanded for one week in the EFCC's custody, adding that if they fail to meet up with the bail condition, they will be remanded at the Nigerian Correctional Service. Oluomo was arraigned alongside three others who are Ola Daya Samuel, Adeyoma Dedeji Taiwo, and Adeyoju Amoke on 11 counts of conspiracy, forgery, stealing, and money laundering preferred against them by the EFCC. On national news, earlier today, the President Major General Muhammad Buhari retired, congratulated the new Prime Minister of Britain, Lee Truss, on her assumption of this trusted position of leadership. Truss, who served as Foreign Secretary until her emergence, defeated top contender Rishi Sunak on Monday under the Conservative Party. This is according to a statement signed by the Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, Femi Adishino. The statement partly read, and I quote, On behalf of the citizens and government of Nigeria, President Muhammad Buhari congratulates the new Prime Minister of Britain, Liz Truss, on her assumption of this trusted position of leadership, end of quote. PSG forward Kylian Mbappe has refused to rule out the possibility of joining Real Madrid despite snubbing the Spanish giants to extend his stay with the Parisians earlier in the summer. Mbappe was heavily linked with a move to Real Madrid in the summer but opted to sign a lucrative three-year contract extension with PSG. The Frenchman's decision to stay with the French champions ruffled a lot of feathers in Madrid, with the reigning European champions feeling misled by the player over his intentions of joining the club and that they wasted a significant amount of time in pursuing his signature. On entertainment, Nigerian artist BNXN, formerly known as Buju, has shared a heartwarming gratitude message acknowledging the love and support that has enabled him to become the Hedy's Award's latest Next Rated star. The singer who clinched the Next Rated Award at the just concluded Hedy's with a brand new Bentley Bentiaga expressed appreciation for his supporters with a tweet attached to a photo of his Hedy's plaque. BNXN said, and I quote, 
God is the Greatest. This is for every fan, listener, supporter, and radio personality who gave me ears when nobody was listening and the ones who stuck with me when nothing was moving. This is for you. End of quote. That's it for daily news on Remo TV. For more news updates, you can visit our website at www.remotv.com.ng. You could also check out our social media platforms on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube at Official Remo TV. I am Naomi Oji. Have a good night.